Well, it happened again. Saturday, I started getting messages. I got messages from um, Nika. It's like I can't find the Facebook group. I go in the Facebook group. I can find the Facebook group. Then about two hours later, got more messages. I couldn't find the Facebook group. Then three hours later, it was gone. Now, we just went through this a few weeks ago. I thought perhaps it was a glitch, but two separate groups, same thing. Now, what I assume, I don't know, but I'm gonna assume and I'm gonna go with it, is that someone is reporting the group because they don't like me, I would say. That's a big part of it. Because I know for a fact there's porn groups, there's damn near pedophilia groups, on, there's all kinds of extreme, over-the-top groups on Facebook, and people have added me to certain groups, and I've unadded myself, and I went back and checked, they're still there. So it's not, quote, the group. Now, part of the process, and I'm not going to go on and on about Facebook, it's their platform, it's their rules, they can have it the way that they want. But I'm done. I'm done with it. I'm not putting any more effort into Facebook groups. I'm not putting any more effort into Facebook fan pages. The one that I have, I'll keep that there for communication purposes, but I'm out. I'm just going right back with another one of Cameron's Law. At some point, all third party platforms behave the same, except this isn't, I mean, the Facebook thing didn't make me money. That's the thing that drives me crazy because I was doing this for you. Hired admins at a hundred bucks for the first 60 days, going up to 250 for you. I was gonna spend money to help you out, yet there's some people who are unhappy. They're unhappy. They're not, they're just, they're just not happy. <laughs> I was in there like, okay. Well, last time it happened, I put together a plan and I was moving away from this anyway. So just for those of you who are interested, this is the loose overlay of the plan. Of the plan, the loose overlay. Number one, it's gonna be a paid group. And during the launch period, I'm gonna set it up for $5 a month. It's gonna be a reoccurring subscription. During the launch period, it's gonna be five bucks a month. I don't expect a bunch of people to come in there. I am looking to cover my admin costs, which it'll be like $7.50 a month when we get there. Now what's gonna happen is, my Amy and I, we've talked about this, there's a lot of people who go through hustlerskungfu.com, get the free courses, and they want service, they want support. And I was like, you know what? Let's give it to them. So Miss Nika, Robert, Jelani, they already have courses there on. They already, you know, I know for a fact Nika's been through the course. So we're going to start off with 30 days. So you can go through the course and then ask questions of someone who went through the course. That's why it's not free. Because I already know what's that uh, Spoken Reasons did it. Asking all those questions, asking all those questions. They'll just become a question fest. And the nominal cost of $5 a month which is if you get in during the lunch period is $60 a year. Essentially what you would spend for a night out on a Saturday in most parts of the US if you go to dinner, if you go to a movie, you're gonna even add more money to that. That's just gonna stop a lot of people from coming in, which is good. So five bucks a month, you'll get overview, training, help, and you can like, hey, I'm taking the child support course. I'm having an issue here. And you can go in the group and talk to other people. See, this is the reason that I've been so adamant about people who are actually taking action. Because if you don't take action, you're gonna continue to ask questions. You're just gonna be a question asking baby all the time. What about this? And let, let's just go ahead and call it for what it is. It's not asking questions, it's fear. You're so afraid to fail. You're so afraid to make a mistake that you don't do shit. And then get mad when someone is like, when you see the results of someone who has done shit, it drives you crazy. So, I let's just say, let's set a goal for a thousand people uh, end of the year in the group because it's gonna start off with five bucks a month. 
then as the launch period intensifies, it's like getting going up, it's gonna go to 9.99, it's gonna go to 10, I'm gonna leave it even. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. When the group's rocking and rolling, it's probably gonna be about 100 bucks a month. But this is gonna be a course of over a year because I'm gonna bring trainers in, I'm gonna get my accountant or an accountant to come in and actually go in their office and talk to them. And I'm not putting this shit up on YouTube because we talk about a lot of heavy duty stuff. So if that sounds like something you wanna be part of and it's coming, I'm going to get the, the oh yeah, it's gonna be my platform. And the one that I have chosen because I've been reviewing it and looking at it for a few months, it's not cheap. It's not cheap at all. That's, that's another thing. So I got the cost of the platform, the cost of it, because admins, we're not going, we're, 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 we are not even, like I said, Facebook doesn't make me any money. You're talking to a dude who didn't have a website for three years and was making a lot of money. <laughs> so I was like, you know what? Just roll with the punches. Uh, let everyone else do that thing because it is now I will say this. If I was dependent upon that group to make money, because I have more students at hustlerskungfu.com than I have in all the Facebook groups they had come on. There are more people over there. And there'll be more people in this new spot. But I want you to think about that. Because I was in a forum, not a forum, I was in a group, and there's this one guy, and he's got like 10,000 members, and that Facebook group is his sole source of income. That's scary, bruh. That's scary. Because if this was my sole source of income, I didn't have any options, I would be really screwed right now. I'd be fucked, as they say. I'd be fucked 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 and fucked and it's just really interesting because uh for for the haters you think you're mad now bro oh just wait you're really gonna be mad because i've learned something the more successful that i am and more important than success is happiness y'all are just losing your damn minds it's just like oh god he's fucking happy oh god he's making money oh shit he's doing this shit he Fuck him. Let me see. Yeah, I can dislike his video. You know what? I'm going to report the group to Facebook. Yeah, yeah. Now, see, this is the thing. When you're doing that shit, you're hurting other people. Now, that's the thing. So, for those of you out there who are, are really wondering what's going on, this is what's going on. This is what you have. <laughs> and uh, it's pretty damn funny. Yep, it's time to upgrade the MacBook Pro. Just being happy. Just being happy. But seriously, all of the um, crazy talk aside, definitely we're going to make this new place very special. And what I mean by that is, and I want you to think about this, because once again, these folks are hurting you, trying to keep you from getting certain information. Because hustlerskungfu.com is going to remain free. Most of the stuff there is going to remain free. And I'm going to go through the shift because now I've got three admin people, plus I will be bringing on another employee to help me with some more stuff. So there'll be three part-timers, two full-timers. Now, one of the things that I think people are missing is, I don't teach you to do shit that I'm not doing, or I don't teach you shit that I have not done. When I got my child support case dismissed, every dude that I know who's been divorced or has a case was looking at me like I was a god. It was like, oh, stop, motherfuckers, no. This, how the fuck did you do that? Now, I'm gonna give you some here, is, you know what that's saying? Don't hate the players, don't hate the game, learn the fucking rules so you can win. Now, what I have under, come to understand, and this is gonna be part of some of the deeper training as we go forward, is the only rules and laws and rights that you have are ones that you can enforce. And if you can't enforce your rights some way, somehow, they don't matter. Uh, just because they're on the books, doesn't matter. Just because there's the Constitution, 
doesn't matter if someone does something that is constitutionally that goes against the constitution and constitutionally illegal unless you have the financial word with all and more important than the finances if you don't have the intellectual capabilities assets to even know what you can do those rights in the constitution don't mean shit to you and i've taken that to heart so what I do, and this is why freedom is so, so, so important, because when you have freedom, you have time. And when you have time, you can investigate and you can research and you can get to meet people who can help you with these things. That is what happens when you have freedom. Freedom is the beginning of everything. And I'm gonna really push a lot of agendas. I'm gonna push my personal code of ethics I'm gonna push my philosophy because right now we're going through this big big shift in terms of work business opportunity culture right now if you were to look at the news and you were look at black lives matter if you were to look at the people at Bernie Sanders rallies the disenfranchised you would think the biggest problem that we have is racism and it's not it's not even close not to say or even marginalize the heinous nature of racism but the biggest problem we have is the emerging of several different classes of elite people who don't need the old system to become wealthy the old system don't need it but you need the old system and as long as you need the old system, you're going to be at the beck and call of this establishment. The big problem that we have is automation. It's a, it's a curse and a blessing because you think the number of jobs, you think it's hard to find a good job now, five years, you will be wishing for that, that $10 an hour fast food job. What's coming in the next five years and what I'm trying to do is prepare as many people to become business owners because see this is the thing the automation is going to continue to roll it's not going to disappear but as a business owner you are now in the position to buy the automation and to buy the software and to buy the machines and employ them for your business so you can still make your money by now investing in you and investing in your business you can have the capital base to play in the future. But, you know, there's many of you who are trying to get around this hard work. I had someone tell me, it's like, I don't want to do that. But, right, and I, I didn't say it, but it's like, if until you can do better, that's what you, that's what's on the table for you. Because one of the things I have with consulting is a lot of people don't want to do what is their strength. I don't know Facebook marketing. I'm not even going to sit here and uh, pretend to know it. I have, I have not spent uh, maybe $10, $20 the whole time I've been on Facebook. I don't know nothing about it. Do you hear me talking about Facebook marketing? I don't know shit about that. You hear me talking about uh, everyone's trying to get me in multi-level marketing or uh, I get a lot of people who were like, hey, Glendon, let's partner. I don't know what the shit you're bringing to the table, all this other stuff. I don't know about multi-level marketing, so I don't mess with it. There's just, I'm staying in my lane. I'm living in my lane and I'm gonna stay there because when I stay and I dance in my lane, I make money. When I hang out in my lane, I make money. When I groove in my lane, I make money. When I pop out of my lane, oh shit. <laughs> Sometimes it works out, most of the time it doesn't. And I do stretch myself, but 90% of my efforts are in my lane which is video, video marketing, business development, sales, sales process. That's where I'm operating, that's where I'm dancing, that's where I'm hanging out. And there's, I would love to be one of those quote gurus of stuff with the Facebook marketing, but I'm not. And what I know is coming, do I have the time to learn that before it changes where it becomes, because this is what's gonna happen with Facebook marketing. You're gonna have to have one of those gurus or a team to run your campaigns to successfully profit and dial down. I know some people are like, I'll learn. Maybe you'll be one of those gurus. But the thing is, 
it's going to take a full-time person it's going to take retargeting campaigns it's going to look like chinese fucking arithmetic on the whiteboard the way your funnel is going to be drawn out and that's what it's going to take to be successful and financially profitable that's what it's going to take and i what i'm doing right now is working so does it make sense for me to stop doing what's working to go over here and i, I say this because there's going to be a lot of stuff in this new place this new thing now i'm putting it together and it's going to be janky that's why it's five bucks but at least i will put it together so people can start to come in and subscribe once again it's five dollars a month during the lunch so with that this is glendon see you in the new facebook uh ha psych i'll see you in the new space see i'm just indoctrinated i must remove the matrix from my dna i'll see you in the new spot and this is going to take a while to develop and i'll just continue to drop information but this was just to let you know what happened where the group went to and what's going on links below